welcome to the vlog. I am wearing a very special hat and you can probably see it by the title of this vlog already that we are going today to Disney Sea. I am so excited. I will say I am a little fatigued and tired and I'm in pain. I laid all morning in the fetal position with really bad cramps and I'm still not feeling that great, but I want to go because A, I've always wanted to go to Disney Sea and I don't know when I'm gonna have this opportunity again. And second of all, or B, it's our last day in Tokyo, our last full day. We leave tomorrow afternoon. We've been here for two full weeks, which has been crazy and so much fun. And I feel like we've seen so much of Tokyo. There's still so much to see though. I'm so excited to see it. I've always wanted to go here. So I'm going to push through the pain and we're going to go check it out. I'm excited for all the snacks. Cal so cute. He came up this morning. He was like, what do you want to do today after the park? And I was like, I don't know. We don't have to spend too much time there if you don't want to. And he was like, well, I want to try all the food. So we're going to go and we're going to spend some time there. So we're going to try all the snacks and get some steps in and just hang out together for our last full day. I'm excited. So let's go to Disney Sea. Yay! The fit for today is ultra, ultra, ultra casual. I'm wearing the Tigger hat because A, it's cute and B, it's covering up all of my dirty hair and my dandruff. I'm wearing a zip up black sweatshirt from Skims with my parallel little white tank top underneath. Leggings are aloe. Shoes are new balances. Gorgeous. Let's hit it. We made it. We're here. Look at the shirt he's wearing today. Oh yeah. Stunning. Gorgeous. Oh, Oh yeah. I am most excited to try the shrimp bun. There are so many things I wanted at the other park, but I didn't realize I think they're only here. So I'm excited to see. I took a quick nap in the taxi. I have a lot more energy now and it's a beautiful day. Woohoo! How are you feeling, Mr. Cow? I'm ready. Meg's ready. We're good to go. And Hades is and ready. Hades. Oh yeah, that guy There we too. go. That guy too. First up, I am parched. I need a drink. What do I want? Apple tea. That's what I want. Yum. Apple tea. This is so cool! Wow! I want to go swimming. <laughs> wow, look how beautiful this is. Oh my god, the water is spurting. It's my dream come true to be here. Look Yay! at that. We did it. We did it. I'm so excited. Okay, I've seen everywhere that this character is super popular and they have like little purses and little stuffies of her, little keychains. Lena Bell, a friend of Duffy. I've never seen her before, but she is adorable. Her ears are so cute. Will you wear these, Cal? Put them on, baby. Put them on. <laughs> cute. You gotta bend down a little so we can see. There we go. Okay, I think this shirt's cute. I like the collegiate vibes, but this one's just so touristy and I like this one too. We found another contender. This Baymax shirt is really cute. <gasps> this is Baymax on the back versus this one. I mean, they're all adorable. Yeah, but I'm leaning towards Baymax. I think he's the winner. Wait, I also like this Mike Wazowski shirt because he's got a little zipper that opens his mouth. And I like the green color. Oh man, now I can't decide. I think I'm leaning towards this pop of green from Mike Wazowski. Mike Wazowski shirt acquired. Let's go. We look crazy, but I love it. You should get the Mickey sunglasses with like six different lenses. It looks so trippy. I did forget sunglasses. I might have to get those later. All right, you walk out of like the main area where there's the big globe. You flip around and you're in this beautiful town. It's kind of giving me like aerial vibes. I'm not exactly sure what it's supposed to be modeled after, but it is stunning. Cal's getting like a European vibe. I mean, they're thinking like Venice everywhere. So like, uh, could be Italy. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, Cafe Portofino. That's the uh, for sure Italian. Ah. Yeah. All right, first meal of the day, we're checking out Cafe Portofino. Ooh, they've got a flight chowder. <laughs> Yum. Fantastic flight chowder. We've got roast beef. They've got some pastas, it looks like. Oh, I love the Very. photos. I love all the fake food, so I can really get a visual. Oh, that looks delicious, the pasta. Oh, it all looks really good. That drink looks refreshing as hell. Sparkling mango and lime. Yum. It's so hot. I think we're gonna save the pasta for another time just because right now I feel like I need something a little lighter because it's so hot out. Perhaps the hot dog? I really want the hot dog and I really want the shrimp bun while we're here. I really want to try the ice cream little clam shell so I'm going to get that first. Refreshing. These are our options. We couldn't decide on just one so we're getting one of each. <laughs> All right, we got one of each to try. I've heard this one honestly not that great but it's just so cute I want to try and I love anything tropical. And then Cal got this one. Yay! Taste test. 
Oh my god. It tastes like frozen pog juice. Hash orange guava? Mm. Hell yeah. Yeah. 10 out of 10. Mm hmm. For a hot day. All right. This one's pretty good. There's like a very faint coffee flavor. I'd rate that like 7 out of 10. It's like a 6. 6 out of 10. Yeah. Cal is a hard one to beat. Cal is quite the critic. Okay. Now we turn hey, our I will say, seashell. Those buns from Disneyland? Yes. We thought they were so good, and then I watched a girl on TikTok saying that they weren't good, and we were like, we thought they were fabulous. Terrific. All right, here is our little seashell ice cream. So cute. Mmm, it's soft. Mmm, mmm. Sorry, I don't want to get people in it. I actually really like it a lot. I wish the shell was crispy. It's kind of soft, but the ice cream is sea salt flavored, and it's good. Mmm. Sea salt ice cream that's got like nice flavor and there's like a jelly jam on the inside. Honestly, really good. I think I like this the best and he likes that the best. This you want to really try this good. one? Sure. The sea salt ice cream is actually really mm -hmm. good. Rate it. This one or that one? I'd say... You love that one. This is good. This mm -hmm. is like an A, that's a seven. All and right. That's a six. <gasps> wow. Fabulous news, you guys. I keep having to put my phone in my purse and then like dig through my purse to find it. And I just realized I can put it in my Mike Wazowski pocket. Beautiful. Now, now we're ready to go for more snacks. This is the craziest park I've ever seen. It just, it doesn't look like anything Disney I've ever seen in my life. Right? So cool. Okay, we've decided after the ice cream we're actually hungry, so we're stopping for some food. They have a spaghetti here with like egg and seafood on top. This chocolate cake looks amazing. Ooh, they've got wine here. Yeah. They've got a seafood pizza. Look at that little long pizza. I've seen that on TikTok. That looks good. I mean, the spaghetti itself looks good too. They've got a churro, some minestrone. All right, we got the goods. Kyle got a beer. I got a nice coffee. We came upstairs to this beautiful seating area. Yeah. We got chocolate cake with mango sauce. The long pizza, which is basically like a baguette with tomato sauce and cheese and pesto. Mm -hmm. Right up your alley. Oh, yeah. And then the piece de resistance. Wow. With the Mickey egg. It looks so good. I don't even know how they do that. That is, I, You know, that's a good question, actually. <laughs> All right. First up, seafood pizza. Bomb. I love veggies on a pizza. <laughs> Solid. That's good. Long pizza taste test. Mmm. Mmm. It reminds me of like pizza, school lunches that I used to get growing up when you would like look forward to pizza day. It's like soft on the inside like that. It's good, but I like the seafood pizza more. Guys, they have a Soarin' ride here. It's a hundred minute wait, so I don't think we're gonna do it, but that's amazing. They have one in California Adventures. It used to be Soarin' over California when I was growing up, and now it's Soarin' over the world. So it'd be cool to see which one that is, but hopefully the line will go down by later. Found the first popcorn stall of the day, black pepper. I want a sweet one, I think. Look at oh. this. We can walk in. Whoa, gal! Okay, we've got a cool ride here. This is awesome! Oh my god, this is so cool! Is there a submarine ride? And there's a restaurant over there! That's amazing! If you stand right here, you can see the roller coaster come out of this little window right here, and all the people scream. Yeah, it's like going, ah. Five, four, three, two, one! Oh, damn. One! <laughs> I'm now realizing I think that the one that we're watching is Journey to the Center of the Earth, which so many of you guys have told me that it's such a fun ride. But I'm honestly a little too scared because I'm a baby back bitch. So I don't know if we're going to do that, but I will be doing Flounder's Flying Fish Coaster. Okay, we're walking to the Mermaid Lagoon, but we walked by the Gyoza Sausage Bun, and Cal wants to try, and I'm going to film him. I think I have to go down this scary area to find said bun. All right, Cal got a bun and a beer. I'm resting my feet. I'm excited Buns to see you try beers. Buns and beers. You gonna go for it? It's really hot. Don't so. burn your taste buds. It's a giant bun. I mean, it looks good. It's big. I got the first piece, so like, a uh, Not much dough. meat. Ooh, it's steamy. Better than I was expecting. Yeah? It's really good. Nice gingery meat. Okay, I had very low expectations for that and I wasn't even gonna have any, but then it smelled really good and that was delicious. We ate like two thirds of it and I put the last third in my purse because I'm gonna want that later. I want this little bang neck so you can clip onto your shirt or your like hat or your purse. So Look at him go. Look at him just holding on. That's the pizza place. They've got a potato churro here. Interesting. I just shrieked like a little girl at the view of Ariel's castle. 
It's so beautiful. Oh my God. This is my favorite thing I've ever seen at Disneyland ever. It's beautiful. I'm in awe. It's so beautiful. The sun is shining really bright, so it's kind of backlit, but just wait till later, you guys. It is, there we go, you can see better. Stunning. We finally found the matcha white chocolate popcorn. I'm getting so full, but this is the flavor that I've been wanting to try, so we must try it. Oh my god. That's Wait, the poo one. one's cute. So every popcorn booth has a different little popcorn carrier, and then you can just pay for refills. And I just like looking at all the different ones. This little honey pot is so cute. I also like the Monsters, Inc. one, which I'm looking for eventually, too. And they sell these little tongs that you can use to eat your popcorn with. Okay, guys, we got the matcha. What was it? Matcha white chocolate popcorn. It's green, and I like all their popcorns because instead of like a powder, they like caramelize each one, so it's covered in like a glaze. I think that's because they have to pop it With on the, the fly, sugar. yeah. Mm -hmm. It's got that earthy matcha flavor. Their flavors for popcorn are pretty spot on too to the actual like name. Mm. I like the really coated ones. Wow, it's really good. I think this is my favorite between the three. When we came to Disney, we got berry cheesecake, chocolate, and now matcha. <laughs> I can't stop eating this stuff. It is so good. I ended the clip in Calgo. Can I have a bite now? <laughs> You're pulling it away. <laughs> this is the first popcorn we finished. We ate it. This is an easy nine and a half. Oh, wow. Yeah. I agree. All right, we're trying Flounder's Flying Fish Coaster. I got popcorn in my teeth. Cal's beer trunk. Is it embarrassing that I'm a little nervous? That's gonna be us soon. We're number one. I'm on this starfish, Cal. You have to stand on this starfish, babe. There we go. Standing on the star. Standing on the star. I don't know if we're gonna fit in this little car. It might be a bit of a tight squeeze for us, too. I got the design off. Oh, I barely fit. Oh my god. Do you fit? I do not fit. <laughs> <laughs> barely fit. Oh my god. Oh, Cal doesn't fit. Oh. Oh. Are you too tall? Oh. You might not fit. Arigato uh, gozaimasu! Arigato gozaimasu! Are you okay? No. Cal's legs. <laughs> you know I did not consider this at all. Arigato gozaimasu! I'm scared. <laughs> okay, you can't play out. I'm scared. <laughs> We're on. Oh my god, I'm nervous. I don't like being at the front. Oh, I'm scared. <laughs> I don't like it! <laughs> I was Joker laughing the whole time because you couldn't handle it. I didn't breathe the whole time. The little kids behind did better than I did. I, I like grabbed this way. We got off and there was actually like a two-year-old crying and I was like, girl, that's me on the inside right now. I don't think I'm gonna have a voice tomorrow. My throat already hurts. Did you have fun? That, it wasn't the craziest roller coaster, but I had so much fun hearing you scream. Oh, thank you. It was you. insane. It went kind of hard for a baby roller coaster, I will say. That was pretty hard. <laughs> it's been about 30 minutes and my throat still hurts from screaming. We're just chilling. Just sitting and relaxing. I can't believe how beautiful this park is. Everything looks so realistic. It's really good. It's really crazy, honestly. There is a carousel with like a hundred genies. You can ride on the genie. This is beautiful. You really feel like you're transported and not in a park. I got another shell ice cream because my throat really hurts from screaming and I need to soothe it. We found this grill and they've got baked chicken. They got baked spicy salmon. The food here is so much better than the food at home. They've got the mochi here. Oh my God, lychee liqueur and milk drink. Oh, that sounds really good. Okay guys, I got this lychee milk drink because I had to try it. It's so beautiful and then she told me to mix it. And then I also got the little green mochis because this is the last time I can have it for a very long time. And even though I'm already getting really full, I just have to have them again. They're so yummy. What'd you get, babe? I got Mickey Nugs. Wow. Oh, pretty. Wow, it looks really pretty. Oh, it's like yogurty. Interesting. It's almost like thick, like yogurty too. Wow. I'm gonna be honest. I don't know if I like it. I like it. It's just not what I was expecting. 
It's growing on me. We're so full, but we found the hot dog bun thing. We just gotta try it. But we're sausage roll. Apparently, it's amazing. Again, we're not gonna be back for a long time, so there's so many things that I want to try. Cute little cart. All they sell here are the sausage rolls. It seems to be a baguette with a kind of beige hot dog sticking out of it. Here I go. We'll do just the sausage first. Mmm. Slight curry <laughs> flavor almost. Overhyped. Damn. Good. What if you put like some mayonnaise on it? Yeah, maybe like a little mustard. I yeah. mean, it's good. Mustard would be really good. I think I had too high of expectations, but this one's gonna love it. I could use sauce for sure. It'll be good, a spicy mayo. Like a Dijon. Mm. I give it a solid six. Like five or six. <laughs> We've decided to ride the boat around the whole park. We're on the boat. Hello, guys. Hat. We left the park. It was so much fun. Cal said it was his favorite Disney park he's ever been to. I agree with that. Ugh. And believe it or not, we are getting more food. There's one last thing we really wanted to try on this trip, and we tried a few times, but just didn't do it. And tonight's the last night we can do it. So we came to get yukatsu. It's my first time ever having it, and I really want to try it. I got my little instructions. So, they gave me like a cutlet that's not fully cooked, and I finished cooking it on here. We got rice, I'm assuming this is miso soup, a little soup, mochi, oh no, mochi, yam, cod roe, pickles, salad. It's so good. Hi guys! Okay, jumping on to end the vlog. We ended up coming home last night and just laying in bed, going to bed super early. I think we went to bed at like 9 p.m. I woke up at 9 a.m. So I slept a full 12 hours and I am rejuvenated. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. We have one last vlog today and that's just coming home. We have a lot to clean as you can see behind us, but I hope you guys enjoyed the Tokyo vlogs. I'm still gonna vlog the whole going home experience. Also, Alicia's coming to Tokyo today and she's landing two hours before we take off. So I'm gonna go try to find her in the airport. Be sure to come back to the next vlog to see if I do that. And I love you guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.